What's up, beauties? This is Marcus with Epic Life Gaming, and I'm bringing you guys another Boom Beach video. So today, you guys, I have uh, this new little machine, the Submarine. So it's pretty awesome. Um, it says the submarine can discover underwater treasures, look for dive locations on the map, Radar 7 required and send the submarine on missions. Upgrade the submarine for deeper dives that yield greater rewards. So, sounds pretty awesome. We can get it upgraded. Um, just need a few more iron, but we'll probably just wait for that. We got a lot to do. Level 9 with the new iron, the new resource. Oh my gosh, it is so tough because you can't create iron um, at level 9, HQ 9. But, uh,. Everything requires it, so I gotta do a lot of raiding. So let's see, we get some wood, some fragments, life and ice. Um, yeah, no. Ooh, two life fragment, ten life fragments and a mystery treasure. Ah, uh, no. Ooh, ten diamonds and two mystery for 168,000 gold. And then <clears throat> we can't get that bottom one, so. Don't even worry about that. Let's check this submarine dive. This one, some stone, wood, and a mystery. It's not bad, not bad. Ooh, iron, mystery, and eight diamonds. That's actually pretty sweet. And uh, six magma fragments and a lot of iron. So that's pretty good, too. Wow, I wish I could get that one. That one's pretty good. So, hmm, I wonder which one we should do. Oh, this 10 diamond one and the two mysteries, I almost, I think that might be the one I do. I really like diamonds. They're one of my favorite resources. When that collector boat comes through and it always, you know, you get to choose three resources every 24 hours, I always choose diamonds. Always, always, always. Because you can do so much more with the diamonds than you can with wood, iron, anything else because diamond works for everything so I usually always choose diamonds so I think I might go ahead yep I'm gonna do that one um, so there we go in one day we'll get that uh, see what those two mysteries are and hopefully they're just a bunch of diamonds so now we're just gonna attack a little bit you guys we got some warriors so you guys have been loving my warriors um, attacks, so I'm just going to keep doing it. Let's see if we can attack this guy. He's got uh, pretty good defenses. couple seven sniper towers. Huh. Let's, let's, let's attack this guy, see what he got. All right, we're going to take out this sniper tower. Boom. Boom. Oh, one more. One more. All right. There we go. See what else we can get. Actually, we're just going to drop the warriors on the beach. Set flare them all the way up at the top of the base. Shock bomb these guys. Shock bomb that, <clears throat> that cannon right there. And that way they can get out of range. And then flare them one more time. Way, way in the back. Come on. There we go. Now let them just go after all this. Get some more uh, energy points. See if they can take down that that uh, HQ. Come on. I think they got it. Because they regain energy as they attack something, as they hit something, they're able to regain their health. And then also with the heal spell, it's hard to take them down unless you got a really strong cannon or a boom cannon um, or a really high level machine gun. They, you really don't have to worry about like a sniper tower and a mortar to hit them. Um, they'll, they'll survive for the most part. So that's what I did right there. Wow, we're able to upgrade a lot of things right now. I've really been focusing on my crafts, um, get them all up to level 9 right now. I think I got one or two of them already upgraded to level 9. Even though I can't hold another warrior, I just want to prepare for it. So that way when I can upgrade them to level 10, 
I'll be able to and I won't have to go up two levels because a lot of people will be like, what's the point? Can't fit another warrior on? Well, the next level you will be able to. So when you're able to upgrade it, you don't want to have to go up two levels. Might as well get it over with now. So that way when you can upgrade to level 10 and can fit another warrior, you're already on your way to doing it. So you only have to go up one level instead of two. So let's attack this player base. I've been attacking a lot more player bases lately. Um, I've actually been doing a lot better. Right here, this guy did the ultimate no-no. He did a triple hit building right there. So, oh, I didn't hit the sniper tower. Oh, well, we got rid of that, uh, that boom mine. So let's see what we can do here. Where are we going to attack? All right. All right, let's just drop the warriors on the beach. We're just going to shock bomb all these. Drop a heal down right in that center there so it heals them up. Come on, come on. Get that flamethrower down. Get the flamethrower down. All right. They kind of spread out a little bit. That isn't good. Ah, they're going down fast. Drop a heal down. Drop a shock bomb. Come on, come on. There they go. We got it, you guys. Except we lost another guy right there at the end. But we're able to take this base down. He had plenty of loot, so more than worth it. It only cost probably about eight, 9000 to regain all my troops back. And I think I got, what, eighty? Yep, 80000 from that. Almost 40000 wood, ice fragment, 2000 stone, and 1700 iron. So a lot of resources from that base. And let's see. Yep, 9,000 coins, gold, to do that, and we got 80,000. So it's so worth it. I was so afraid before to attack a player base because of how much I would lose, like how many of my guys I would lose, and it would take forever to regain. But now it's all right. Who cares if you lose a few warriors? Um, the loot's definitely worth it. And as you can see, we're maxed out on wood, iron, and almost stone. Gold's hard to max out because you're always using it for your troops. And also uh, your radar, which we'll probably get that actually going. Um, I definitely want to upgrade my radar. Definitely got to get all my defenses upgraded. There's just a lot to do. Just got to HQ level 9. So plenty more to upgrade. A lot to do. I was going through 1 through 7 so fast. Just upgrading, upgrading, upgrading my HQ over and over. And then I get to HQ8 and it definitely slowed down and now HQ9 is going to take forever because you can't produce iron and you only can attack it. And the non-player bases, you get so little, I mean like 100, 200, 300 iron at a time from these uh, NPC bases. So it takes a long time to get, what was that radar, like 4,000, 3,000? Um, so that's that's a lot of those NPC bases. Ooh, this guy has a lot of loot. A lot of iron at least. 3,000 iron. I wonder if we can take this guy. Looks like he has pretty kind of low defenses. Couple level 8 sniper towers. We'll see. We'll wait. We'll wait for that guy. Let's see this resource base. All right, this resource base, it looks so easy, but it's not. It's a lot tougher than what it looks like with two boom cannons and a machine gun. I've tried this base one or two times, and I have yet to win yet. I've taken it over, I think, twice, but ever since it got to uh, level 18, I can't take it over. I don't know if I'm doing the wrong strategy, so leave in the comments below. Um, how, well, how you guys attack boom cannons because this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to do, uh, what what was that, four more uh, artilleries to take down that one boom cannon. That's a crazy amount. I'm going to drop the warriors on the beach. Flare them right towards this boom cannon. Shock bomb all three. But see, it takes so long to get to that boom cannon. Come on, come on. Now I don't. I only have one. I have two uh, energies left. Come on, come on, flare that one and so. Oh, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, we're down to four, three, 
two zero. Oh my gosh, gosh! I can never beat this one. Leave in the comments below how you guys would attack that because I can't seem to beat that one. Maybe warriors aren't the answer for that base. Maybe something else is. So leave in the comments below. Um, so hopefully you guys like this uh, Boom Beach video. You guys have been liking all the other ones. Um, Hammerman HQ25 is coming up. So stay tuned for that. Let's get to 20 likes, you guys. You guys are awesome. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. You guys have a great day, and don't forget to stay beautiful.